one man said to our man, did you hear about a legend of a he, he used to be a boy, but he got turned into a The other guy said, no, I haven't heard about that. David's dad basically said this. This is basically what this building is. It's a hotel tower and it's on the edge of the water. Our unit is on the two floors. The bedroom is up there is up in, and the den is up there as well. There's two bedrooms and a den up there. Did I go on the balcony? David's dad said, sure, you can go on the balcony. David basically said, Dad tells me when I am in school, I'll make you fan. But is that true? Will people really like me? I don't really know. So I'm going to say to myself if we take a set. We heard we had a fan. Oh, we heard we had a fan. I would be so happy. Indeed, if I only had a friend, oh, I'd go for a walk with my friend. I would say hi to all the people that we meet. Indeed, if I only had a friend, indeed, oh, we would be best buddy, a uh, best buddy it could be if I only had a friend. If I only had a friend, oh, we would go her walk. Mm -hmm. We would smile at the people that we met. If I only had a friend, oh, you could be my friend indeed. Dear Billy said, I think I hear my dad calling me to go to the bed, so I'm going to go inside and go to sleep. Okay, it was basically the next day, and it was time for school. So David had to go to school, so he said goodbye to his dad. He was going to go to school, and his dad was going to go off to work. Okay, David basically at school. He met two girls at lunch, Jackie and Tina. He liked T Jackie and Tina a lot. Jackie and Tina and like David. David called his father out and asked if he could have Jackie and Tina over a hunting. His father said that was fine. He made new friends. That was fine. David said okay. Okay, goal finished for the day. So David, Jackie, and Tina went over to David's house to hang out. Okay, they were basically in David's room hanging out. So they were saying what to do. And then Jackie said to David, Have you ever heard about a legend of a David said, No, I have never heard that legend of a monster. Tina said, It is true. The monster comes and scares people and eats them. David said, Oh no, I'm scared. I'm really scared, guys. That's a real funny one, isn't it? Jackie said, it's not funny, it's true.
Okay, it basically got to the point where Tina and Jackie had to go back home. So they said goodbye to Dear and they said, be careful about the water because the water might come and eat you. Dear said, oh, I'm not going to be scared. So he said goodbye to his friends and they her out the door. Okay, later that night, when Dear went to sleep. He was tired, and it was going to be a good luck by going to sleep on his own. When he was asleep, something woke him up. He looked out the window and he saw the water. He was scared. With a light and two, yes, it was true. So he didn't walk in closet because he was scared. Oh, I'm scared of the monster, yeah, and you. I'm hiding in my walk in closet, and you. I don't want to leave here, I'm trying to be brave But I'm scared of the mother and little lady cat I'm scared of the mother, so I hide it in my walking closet Hoping that the mother will not bother me I'm scared of the mother, so I can do I'm hiding in my walking closet, hoping that the the mother won't bother me, but I love yeah, a cat and Okay, David's dad was basically back at home. He was home at her log meeting at work. Went on for a long time. David's dad said to David, Why are you in your closet? David said, I'm scared of the mother. David's dad said, there's no such thing on my and aren't you a little bit too old to be scared of my heart? said, I guess so, but I saw a monster. David's dad said, just go to bed, David. David said, okay, I'll go to bed. It basically was the next night, and David was asleep. Something woken up, it was a monster again. He saw the monster out of his bedroom window. He was scared, but this time he was going to make certain that he was not going to be scared. And he was scared, so he ran to the window and banged on the glass of the window, which basically knocked the monster down to the ground. Was the monster dead? They did not know. Peter basically said this, Who free me from the curse of water? I want to thank them. Help me. Free lady to me. Who you are? I want to thank you for freeing me from the curse of water. Dee basically heard the cry of the boy and ran downstairs and went outside and said, What's your name? The boy said, my name is Peter. I thank you for freeing me from the car of the monster. Dear said, I heard you. Come on inside. I think it's going to rain soon. Peter said, if you call it because the car of the monster is over. Dear said, I see. It was the next day. It was Saturday. David basically had to find Peter. But Peter had to go back go on to where he lived. And he said, I'll, I'll see you around sometime. David, and thank you for freeing me from that water. David said, You're welcome. This was the day when David had a new friend, so he not just had Jackie and Tina, he had Peter now and his friend too. And David was happy. He was very happy too.
like this on my channel. We do animated movie and we do review on movie and video games. We also do travel stuff and new stuff. So I hope you are right to my channel if you want to see more of this from me.